Sneaker fan, what up? Jake back again with another video unboxing. And hey, I probably wasn't making any videos in a week and a half. But that doesn't mean I wasn't active on YouTube answering questions and answering questions on my on my IG. And it doesn't mean I haven't been buying kicks because I've definitely been, bu been buying kicks. So without further ado, let's get this thing going. I'll open this bad boy up. And of course, y'all seeing the title. I already know what it is. Listen, everybody has been doing reviews on this. I got these shoes all last week, but hey, I, last week I just decided not to do the video on it until now. Of course, you got the premium box, and these boys were not cheap. As you see, Air Jordan 3 SE Special Edition. And this is the animal, it's not the animal pack, it's the animal instinct. And yo, <laughs> these shoes, I mean, these shoes are nice. And I'm saying, I, I, listen, I bought this shoe specifically just to be like a collector's item. I have no intention, even though they look nice, I had and have no intentions on rocking these. I feel like these shoes are gonna go up in price once they all sell out. This shoe does remind me of the social status sixes that I do have, and I didn't do a video on it when I got them. You know, pony hair, cow fur, whatever they wanna call it. You know, has the air joint in the bottom, the gum bottom, white. Black and white midsole. I guess you got the zebra, leopard, cheetah, everything you want to call it, red jump man. But listen, these shoes are well put together and clean. These things are clean. I love the embroidering on the jump man. It has like a nice, like a silky tongue. This is clean. I definitely wasn't expecting this. Red jump man on the inside. Red insole. This is sweet. This is a sweet shoe. It feels it feels weird. It definitely feels weird. This this fur is like scary. I'm 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 wondering if it says where this material was made from. You know, like the social status says it was whatever Cambodian, whatever animal it was. I don't even remember. <laughs> but this is sweet. I like this. I still don't like the, the, the Jumpman branding. I'd rather the Nike Air. I think it would have brought it out more. Let's take a look at the second shoe. And this is a, so this shoe is definitely not going back to the outlet. Definitely keeping this shoe. Definitely investment purposes, keeping these bad boys. The second one came, they both came unlaced, but I love the print on here. This is a this is nice. I don't care. I know people were complaining like they wanted you know elephant print or something like that, but I love the the animal print on here. Very nice. Very nice. I'm feeling this shoe. Definitely feeling this shoe as well. Just like my dorm bag. Oh, here it is. So we're gonna see what all this material is made from. It is. I'm sorry, I'm gonna move. This shoe contains real fur, fur type dyed adult brown fur. Uh, origin, Brazil. Bohemian Drive, bovine fur. Bull fur, cow or bull, bovine. All right, gotcha. That is what's up, that's why it feels funky. So uh, all you animal lovers, tree huggers, vegans, this ain't the shoe for you. Sorry. Ah, uh, but sweet shoe. I'm gonna put this bad boy up. I love animals, but yeah. It is what it is. Yeah. Receipt in here. 
Next shoe. Sorry about that. Ah, I waited on these bad boys. Decided not to get them. At first release, then Christmas Eve, walked over to my Foot Locker. They didn't have my size. And went to my uh, Foot Action and they had them. And this is what Foot Action does, at least that they told me. You see this here where they stuffed this here? That means it hasn't been touched. No one messed with the shoe. No one's wore it, never been returned. So that's the new thing, I guess, that Foot Action's doing, I guess, retail stores, not sure. But I picked up these fours, which look like the M&M fours, the winterized fours. I had my eyes on these from the beginning, and I was like, ah, I'm not gonna get them. And then they sat, and then he went straight to cart and Nike.com. And then I seen them slowly disappearing on Nike.com. I'm like, oh shoot, I'm not gonna be able to get these things. So I said, you know what? If I got some extra cash hanging around, I go ahead and pick them up. So that's what I did. Went to my foot action. My boy Bert hooked me up with them. And um, I like them. They're different. Uh, it's the winterized, so it's a winter shoe. So there's no netting, uh, the, the standard netting. So I guess it's like built for snow to get wet and to handle uh, the adverse weather, cold weather. So I can dig it. I can dig it. Let's see on the inside what it says here. Same typical uh, Jordan, a nice infrared type tongue, black insole with the red jump man, size 12 personal size. Typical, typical Jordan 4. Like I say, just they switched this up a little bit. It really does look like the M&M, so people are calling it the M&M 4. So it's a great uh, replacement, a good uh, substitution uh, for that. If you had that, Nike Air would have made this shoe kind of a... Uh, would have made the shoe stand out a bit more, and I'm sure a lot more people would have been all over it. I'm gonna take a look at the right shoe. I like the gray bottom, jump man. Nike Air would have been nice. I'm gonna keep saying that. Strong, high tongue. This feels like it's rubber almost. Has the flight. Go back around it again. There you have it. I like this shoe. This is a shoe I'm actually gonna rock. I'm gonna wear this shoe. Don't know with what, but I'm gonna find something to wear with these bad boys because I like them. These are sweet. And there's been fakes of these out way before. Uh, I mean, when they when the pictures of these leaked out, that these were, these were coming out, the fakes were already out. Am I gonna buy a fake to do a real fake? No, nah, these shoes didn't sell out. It's nothing popular. It's, it's a nice shoe, but no one's, there's no need to buy a fake shoe to do a real fake. You know, the fakes aren't cheap. I don't buy cheap fakes and I don't have like a hookup like that where someone's just shipping me free shoes like that. So I, I'm in no uh, collaboration, coordination like that. So that's not happening. Let me know what you guys think of these two shoes. Jordan 3 Animal. Oh, also, there's no, listen, the fake companies in China don't like making threes. The threes do not sell. And right now, there is no fake version of those Jordan 3 Animal Instinct. I'm telling you guys right now. I've done a little research, did some looking around, and there is no fake one yet. Will they produce it? Probably not, because like I said, Jordan 3s, they don't sell on the fake market because they don't look good. Maybe an Oregon or something like that or a Doug version or something like that, but they don't they don't sell very well. And when I do my review on the uh, Justin Timberlake Super Bowl uh, threes, which I suppose had done a long time ago, I'm going to explain the story when I spoke to one of the guys in China and they explained to me everything that was going on uh, with the Jordan threes in the particular factory. 
uh, that makes them. So that's my story and I'm sticking to it. It's your boy Jake signing out. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Like I say, I'm active on Instagram, active on YouTube in the comments. Love interacting with y'all. Whether y'all trolling or not, anything, it doesn't matter. I'm here. Peace out.